You were at Kingston and Kennedy and Cedar Falls in a big game with playoff implications. Yeah, playoff implications, but who would have thought coming into this game, no kidding. both teams would have a losing record. I yeah. mean, well, Kennedy's played the toughest schedule in 5A, so win tonight and next week, and the Cougars could be in the playoff field at 4-5. and five. It's been a disappointing year for Kennedy, so the Cougars looking for a little redemption tonight. They go right down the field on the first possession. Vinny Gianforte hits Dawson Doherty on the slant, and then later, it's Pierce McCrary on the old slot back trap. 60% of the time works every time. You remember the slot back trap, right? I do, Scott? yes. You that? <laughs> Unfortunately, that's all for Kennedy. I mean, after that, it was all Cedar Falls and pretty much all this man, Devarian Clark. He was a workhorse tonight for the Tigers. They were up 14-7 at halftime. Third quarter more of that man, Clark. This run sets up another Tiger touchdown. This time the quick hitter to Ben Backus. Cedar Falls scores the last 28 wow. points of this one, and they eliminate the Cougars 28-7 to tonight. They win. They eliminate the Cougars from playoff contention. The Tigers, however, could be in the playoffs. If they win next week, they could make it. It depends how the RPI shakes out. Scott, get this. I went back to 2004. Yeah. I, I haven't seen they're the in the playoffs yeah, every they're, year. They're in the play playoffs yeah. every year, except COVID, of course. Yeah, and but. I wouldn't want to play them in the playoffs this year. They look like right. they got it going on. Yeah. Thanks, Jason. I was yep.